Kiko died on Monday night with scores others sustaining injuries after multiple car crash at Salama, that is along the Nairobi-Mombasa Highway. Four people died on the spot at the Mlima Q area after lorry ferrying construction materials collided head-on with two passenger vehicles with seven others dying while undergoing treatment in Makweni. Loro Tieno reports on the unfortunate turn of events even as NTSA vowed to continue with the nationwide crackdown to reduce road fatalities. At Mlimakiu area in Salama, Makweni County, police supervised the towing of the wreckage of the Monday night horror crash that has left 11 people dead. According to survivors, the driver of this lorry rammed head-on into a 14-seater van before veering off and hitting another 18-seater van at around 8 p.m. on Monday. So ikakuja mimi sasa venye nimeiona hivyo nikajaribu kuiepa lakini speed yangu ilikuwa ilikuwa chini nilikuwa speed ya 10 so ilikuwa too late mimi kwanza nilikuwa nimerara nilikuwa kwa kitia hii ya nyuma pale hii ka kitanda ya roli nimerara so i could not seek to understand chenye kilifanyika vizuri but what i had was a bank kuamka tu hivi dakika kidogo ijipata chini ya roli we managed to rescue around 12 uh, victims of the accident and one of the victims uh, a 9 year old boy succumbed on arrival at the hospital uh, the rest of the patients were managed well and they were transferred to makindu Six of those who perished in the crash are members of a family from Nakuru. The family was in a convoy of three hired vehicles, including the ill-fated 14-seater Matatu that was hit by the lorry. Their Easter festivities ended on a tragic note, with seven other relatives still receiving treatment. We were from Mombasa. We had gone for the Easter holidays to my aunt's place. And so on coming back, one of the cars that we had collided with a trailer. The ones in Nakuru currently, there are three. The, those ones are in stable condition. But we left uh, four in Makindu. Those ones are a bit unstable and critical. This comes even as the National Transport and Safety Authority vowed to continue with the multi-agency crackdown in a bid to tame road carnage. The majority of what we're seeing is driver behavior uh, being a major concern uh, to us, especially we see how the speeding that occurs and the lead in discipline when they're not keeping onto their lanes. So we urge motorists to please uh, slow down and keep onto their lanes uh, and that's clear. The bodies of the deceased have been moved to the Sultan Hamoud County Morgue. Laura Otieno, Citizen TV.